all the way back. All the way back. Behind cars. Behind cars. Some very scary moments overnight for police, for neighbors there, and also our crew at a standoff in uh, Phoenix. A suspect in an apartment complex got into a shootout with police after he shot and killed a woman and two children. Unbelievable On Christmas, story. this all unfolding near 16th Street in Highland. Uh, so we want to check in right now with Cameron Riddle, who's joining us live from the scene. Cameron, good morning. Good morning. Yes, this is still an active scene uh, as Christmas was just now hours ago. It took a horrible turn for one family here in Phoenix, as well as the hundreds of others who live in this apartment complex, the Highland Apartments at 16th Street and Highland in Central Phoenix. Take a look at some of this dramatic and scary video from last night. This was a standoff that went on for the better part of six hours. It started in the daylight hours, and if you were watching uh, 3 TV News last night at 9 and 10 o'clock and you saw Derek Stahl's reports at 9 o'clock things were pretty calm here as they were at 10 o'clock but at around 10 05 to uh, 10 15 things got uh, really rather exciting and dangerous out here for uh, the people who live here the news crews and the police officers but it was no worse for the people that this was surrounded by police tell us that when they got here they found a woman uh, with gunshot wounds to her body in the parking lot she was pronounced dead on the scene. Police also went inside that apartment where they found other people involved. They found an adult female deceased inside the parking lot. The initial officers on scene tracked the suspect down to one of the specific apartments inside and we learned that it was uh, a person with this uh, whom this woman had a relationship in the past. I don't know if that's an ex-husband, ex-wife, boyfriend, girlfriend, but there is a domestic violence relationship between these two. Uh, at the time that he entered the house, witnesses reported that he had two children with him that we believe are uh, in common between our victim and our suspect. There was aged 10 months uh, and an 11-year-old child. Later, police had confirmed that uh, both of those children, ages 10 months and the 11-year-old child, uh, were also shot and killed here on this scene. Police tell us that at one point throughout the evening, the uh, the man involved in this had told other family members that he intended to kill the other children. At one point, another officer was also injured, apparently by possible shrapnel, as this went back and forth for multiple hours last night and a standoff and then some intense moments of action around 10 o'clock uh, last night. This morning, we are still working to learn more details about who these people are and why all this happened. Of course, the uh, the person involved, the shooter and all this, is not among the dead this morning. A horrible way to end a Christmas here in 2017 for not only this family, but all the people who live here.